हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू लारावल 11 रोल्स एंड परमिशन लास्ट वीडियो वी आर डिस्कस अबाउट रोल्स लाइक यू आर क्रिएटिंग योर रोल्स लाइक एड एडिट एंड डिलीट्स सो इन दिस वीडियो वी कैन कवर एक्टिव क्लास सपोज यू आर गोइंग टू रोल्स सो वी नीड टू हाईलाइट सेम एज अ रोल्स लाइक अ एक्टिव एंड वी कैन ऑल्सो क्रिएट सम पेजेस सो वी कैन वर्क एज अ परमिशन वर्क वी आर डिस्कस दिस टाइम मीन्स इंट्रोडक्शन टाइम वी आर डिस्कस सम पेजेस लाइक अ dashboard for users roles category sub category product setting and logout so we need to create some pages in sidebar so i can show you how to work permission without page how i can show the permission so in this video i will cover like a active class and also i will create a some pages before we can start you are new in the channel or in the series so please subscribe and please press the bell icon so whatever content we are uploading so always get the notification and you can start immediately new thing learning and also do you want to buy any script just go to our official website errorsolutioncode.com and you can buy it here you can see it here okay and do you want to develop as a freelancer work just you can go to telegram skype and whatsapp you can contact me let's start now so first of all we need to sort out like a segment wise active class so just go to resources views inside panel inside layout inside sidebar.blade.php suppose you are doing in your personal projects and personal project do you want to add a active class so how we can do it you can understand here also right now you can see it here is the active class available inside a dashboard because of here is another class said so this class is a meaning about like active class non active class suppose in this themes working like a collapsed suppose i can remove this ones and i just go back again refresh the page so you can see it here like a user also active so whatever page there we don't want to show this class inside and other page we need to show this class suppose you are using active class so active class do you want to show and no need to show simple it is a condition wise work so what we can do it here we need to get a segment so i already get this code how we can got a segment suppose i can put here okay just i can make comma and sorry dash and after request segment 1 let's go back again refresh the page here suppose i refresh the page so you can see my segment 1 so means i get a panel inside a url suppose i will do segment 2 and i just refresh the page so i get a roles because segment 1 and segment 2 suppose here is another segment there so you need to put like 3 suppose i'm going to dashboard so you can see it here is a segment 2 means dashboard you can see it here so we are getting simple we need to make here condition Just selects. Here you can go. If request segment two is equal to is equal to dashboard. So we need to go inside and end it. Suppose I can put here qualified class like a, so is not working active class. So what we can do not is equal to. Just you can put like a not is equal to dashboard. Suppose dashboard not there. So we need to go inside. Let's go back again, refresh the page so you can understand. So when I go to users means roles, so you can see here user highlight because of the here we have removed already class before testing time. This reason. So when I add a class here, and just go back again, refresh the page here. So you can see not highlighting dashboard because I am there in roles. Suppose I am going to dashboard, so it's highlighting. Same thing we can go to roles, so it's not highlighting because of I have not added. class so just you can copy paste for this condition and you can put every place now after you need to change your segment 2 so here is the roles here is the users let's go back again refresh the page here so you can see roles now highlights so you can understand where are you this reason last video i have created video so always i am doing like a panel slash role slash add so role always highlight because segment 2 always active suppose i am doing the edit so also you can see troll always highlight this reason i have did like this url in last video okay so now is a segment means the active class you better way understand suppose your side is a different class do you want to put like this is equal to is equal to active here so also put not is equal to you can put whatever themes work like this but you are understanding here for this condition how we can get this segment how we can add a condition inside active class otherwise call it a class whatever class you are set there you can do it okay so now we need to create a some pages like we have discussed in our uh, introduction time 
how to work uh, permission rules so we need some pages so simply we need to open laravel 11 and permission these files and we need to create a one by one all the pages suppose i copy like a category so i can put here categories also i can change here categories here also i can roles inside category now we need to work like a subcategory so just you can copy paste again subcategory and here also you can change like subcategory also you can change here and you can remove the as means as a capital letter you can remove and make a small letters okay next one here there product so we can put here product and you can put it here product also I need some pages otherwise how I can provide a permission this is the reason I am creating some pages for this projects okay and setting here you can see it setting so let's copy and paste here let's go back again we can refresh the page so we can check space created not created is 100 percent created all the page category subcategory product and setting also you can put logout button so it's possible we have already did here so we don't want to do now this is the permission wise we can work suppose here you can provide like edit inside otherwise you can provide here another button so also possible and you can provide all the list like a category inside you need to be the permission subcategory inside you need to provide a permission product inside you need to provide a permission and setting inside you need to provide a permission all thing available but is a next video in this video we can cover pages because now i can open the users so just click on the panel users so we need to create all the pages one by one let's go back again routes web.php and here i can create a page so panel users just copy paste code so you can possibly here you can make like user controller and here you can make like a list just go up and you can declare here user controller okay now you can go back again and here you can create a new controller same thing we did like your role controller like this you can do it like a user controller but php and just copy role controller and put here it's very simple job but we need to do in this project this reason i am doing otherwise i know people don't like like this way you can create but we need to do permission work so we need this reason i will explain another topic here like a active class okay so just go back again and list and here you can see role we don't want to need like this so just remove and here also you can remove the data here you also you can change to user to list so just you can create a new folder inside uh, panels and inside you can create a users list.blade.php file okay now you can go to roles inside a list and you can copy and put here and you can remove this table inside all the data because of generate the error this is the reasons and also you can change like a user once we can create a routes this time we can use this reason and here you can make like a user list and also you can provide a user list okay let's go back again refresh the page here so you can see it is working very well user user list and here is a add users same thing we can do it category subcategory and product and settings so i will do my way because it's very simple suppose you need to do your way so you can do it okay i think i will do but next video because we can use for the category subcategory product and setting this time i can show you how we can do it right now i can't show because of the we are creating just pages is not good for just i show you the user page for the active class you can see it here so when dashboard role users and roles you see so next video what we can do we can create a new pages here as a permission once you can create a ad and here you can provide a permission pages you click one so showing the all the menu and after users against what what permission like add user edit user and delete user and show user means manage user like four permission available list add edit and delete suppose list permission available so edit and delete and add available so list permission is not available so how it's possible add edit delete is possible same thing inside rules same thing inside category subcategory product and setting 
everything I can show you in next video okay and do you have any question about active class so please comment out and do you want to like this video so please like and do you want to see like this video more so please subscribe our error solution and thank you for watching error solutions